Plain Old Zach presents a day out with my kids and family. Today we're here at SeaWorld San Diego. Um, she has a lot of dark, which are really light in color with a dark spot. Touch it! What do you think? Oh, there's another one right there. Oh, that's cool! And here we have the horseshoe crab. Of course you can touch them. Did you know that horseshoe crabs have ten eyes? Including some that can see UV light. This used to be the Anheuser-Busch Gardens where they used to have the Clydesdales, all sorts of cool stuff. But now that it's switched ownership, it's now uh, the Cafe 64 handcrafted burgers and local brews. Here at Cafe 64, they have several local brews which you can get on tap. Plus they have this burger joint over here that's got some really great hamburgers. The beer is smooth and the sights are beautiful. Now tell me that doesn't look good. And this used to be where they had the flags of all of the states and they even had a gigantic map of the United States here where you could run from state to state. Today it is a place where they have mini ponies and other animals. And here we have the Atlantis ride. Big Splash at the Wild Arctic and Penguin Encounter. At Wild Arctic you can see baleen whales and polar bears. At the Penguin Encounter you can see sharks. Just kidding, you can see penguins. Here we've got the penguins. Actually, I believe those are emperor penguins. Emperor king. We've got the puffins. Here we have the Magellanic penguins, right outside of the penguin encounter. The Wild Arctic attraction actually has a ride on it where you are on a helicopter that goes through the Arctic. And this is supposedly the helicopter that we were on. So over here we have what uh, is supposed to be the uh, wreckage from a ship. About this area is this ice wall. It's all icy and cold. And now this is some fish in the polar bear area. I think that they're bass or salmon, but I'm not really sure. These are the beluga whales. This 
like at the end of every ride, we have a store to go walk through as we leave. Is that on the other side, right over here, we have year-round Christmas stuff. One of the best things about SeaWorld is all the flora and fauna. I mean, it is just gorgeous here. Their landscapers do a fantastic job. Absolutely fantastic. One thing that you gotta say about SeaWorld is, man, the food here is good. SeaWorld is a really fun place to visit, if only for a couple of hours. And we only saw a third of the park.